So Kate, welcome back to Clarence. It's been a long road with uh, the wonderful world star and at last he's back in competition, just on his first competition for how many years? Two and a half years since he's been out. It was um, CDI 2012. It's been a rocky road and I've got to say then a couple of weeks ago you retired Oscar B from competition, which yep. must be a big lump in your throat when you consider how far he's taken you around the world and back and, and uh, thanks to Rosie Vital, I guess you got a couple more years out of him in the end. He was always a little bit difficult to... How old now? 18? He's, yeah, I'm turning 19. And you you think that the Rosie really helped him towards the end? Oh, yeah, definitely. Like, even like this week, he still acts five in the paddock, like galloping around like an idiot. But um, no, I really appreciate being able to have those last 18 months with him. It, it was really nice to be able to see him out you know, as the horse I knew he could be, that Grand Prix horse. So. Yeah, and he had a win just before he retired as well, which yeah, made it even did. better. Yeah. yeah, personal best, fantastic. Yeah. So, and he took you around the world and gave, gave you so much experience, and of course you can use that experience on your up and coming ones, which yeah. you've got two really beautiful young ones in Flaws, yeah. and uh, with World Star, yeah. who you say has been a long time since he's competed. Yeah, it's been a really long journey um, of ups and downs with him after an unfortunate accident. Um, he suffered um, and then my sickness um, but now yeah he felt fantastic today and um, oh, 70 percent okay. over 70 percent of your first outing for two and a half years it's pretty fantastic yeah 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 but that was like at half pace because you know he was a bit hot but um no it was um, really fantastic and um, my little baby was well, not a baby anymore but Ferenz is stepping up to big school now absolutely and, yeah. state championships were fantastic yep. and you, your opinion about how Rose Hip Vitals helped you with these guys I know we have heard with Oscar and it's been a while now since we've spoken to you but uh, with Florence who was so good at the at the state championships yep. really high placings and he was a little bit out of his league he's only just young into that level and was like mm. second yeah. quite amazing so how do you think it he helps him I know that Rose Hip helps lots of horses in different ways yeah well be, at the moment you know he doesn't have any touch wood structural problems but um He's so big and the work we ask for them is so taxing on their muscles and joints and that. I just think that it just makes him fresh every training session. So every day, if you have a really hard session, the next day he feels really fresh to go again, yeah. which I really like. So it really keeps him healthy, huh? Yeah, really yeah. happy to work, focused <laughs> on the job. That's he looked really a million like. dollars at the state championships. His coat was sensational. Yeah. He looked fantastic. Yeah, he's feeling yeah amazing. So no, that's really exciting. And with uh, with. The golden child, golden uh, child. Bubble Boy, Bubble Boy World Star, who has more things. He's another. You seem to manage to collect hypochondriacs along know. the way. And uh, I think anyway, talk. yeah, <laughs> you should separate them a lot further than a stable. But with him, I know he's had a few respiratory problems. Yeah. And I know what's your feeling with um, Rose Hip with this one? Well, since arriving um, in Australia, he's had a lot of allergies and respiratory problems um, that I found really hard to get under control. But yeah, um, since the Rose Hip, you know, he's been fine with everything and even with that real windy time we had and, um, and that dry dusty weather nothing flat. Because I know you tried you tried everything didn't you? Everything. everything. Yeah. You were at vets and vets and more vets and more this and more that yep. and now nothing except rosehip? Nothing except rosehip. Amazing huh? Yep. And yourself? Oh and me yes <laughs> I love it. <laughs> I know at one stage I had you know eight or nine horses in work a day and it was just the only way I could keep going, I think, was the rose hip. Because I stopped for a few days and, geez, did I feel it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it really makes a difference. Makes I, I a must difference. say, I'm on it as well. And I just find if I stop taking it for whatever reason, I run out for a few yeah. days or something, within four or five days, I really feel a huge yeah. difference. So there's yeah. no question that it really helps me a lot yeah. as well. Just to be able to get out of bed every morning. And yeah. Keep going. Walk down the stairs. Exactly. <laughs> You're not quite as old as I am. <laughs> not yet. I've been through a few surgeries, though. <laughs> True. <laughs> Yeah, well, I, I must say, um, you know, Worldstar looked sensational. I saw him in his warm-up, but he looked just like he did two and a half years ago, if he not better. He still caught out in the walk, too. Oh, did he? <laughs> I forgot that. <laughs> Some things never change. <laughs> Have to give him more rose hip. Yes. So, um, yeah, so it's exciting times ahead for you with two really beautiful young horses, and yep. they're both very seriously competitive, and especially Worldstar. It must make you feel great, huh? Yeah, I mean, it's it's great. They're totally opposite horses, and I love riding horses that are totally opposite. Yeah. Um, but, yeah, no, they're both really exciting, and I'm, I'm looking forward to, to, to the rest of this year and next year. So how far off is World Cup and Grand Prix, Kate? Well, I've been, because I've been good and not pushing him too much because he hasn't done a lot of work, but um, he's definitely got the PR and Passage, and it's it's all there. Now it's just putting it together, so. Yep, I've seen it. It looks fantastic. Yeah. So uh, he's very, very exciting horse. Always was, and uh, 
the two and a half years not seeing him, it seems like he's been around and we haven't missed him at all. Really seeing him go today just belongs out there. It's fantastic. Congratulations, great job. Thanks, Rose. And, uh, yeah. Thanks for all your help. No too. problem. Yeah, it's a pleasure. And thanks to Rose here, I'm sure. Yes, definitely. Yep, there's no question. So, yeah, well, good luck with the rest. You've got no more classes today with him. You're just starting him slowly. So, yep. uh, good luck, and we look forward to see you moving up the ranks with more 70% in a Grand Prix oh, start no, soon. I can't wait. Great, Thank Kate. Thank you. Thank you.